Welcome back to the flail playthrough everyone slash yo yo and today we are gonna try and make some progression here but I have a new mod installed that adds in a good couple of flails because I said in the last episode we'd be focusing on flails so let's check it out I don't remember the name of the mod but it adds in a lot of flails look at this holy shit I got a burp <coughs> I burped all right and a man type flail Stop. <laughs> Boreal Flail. Chlorophyte Crusher. Chlorophyte Smasher. What's the difference there? Very quick and powerful. Uh, Evanwood. Nightmare. Here we go. We can make a Nightmare one. We kind of have like pretty decent ones as it is. In the last episode, we got the Juggernaut. And then off camera, I made this. The uh, Flesh Mace. And I've been making this thing up here. Because, uh, well, it's still a work in progress. And this is pretty much just for testing out uh, how far yo-yo, my yo-yo, can go. So it seems like this one, you know, reaches to the end of the purple. This one can reach a little bit past the yellow into the blue. Flails, on the other hand, I don't really care how far these go. Flails are flails, man. But for the flails, we will have, uh, you know, a bunch of dummies to just beat up right here. Then we can place this guy over here. But yeah, this is what the flesh one does. It has a chance to life steal, but it negates uh, life regeneration. Which is kind of end. Then this baby right here. Oh my god, this thing is a beautiful. It's a beautiful mace. I like it a lot. Shit, I still have a deck hand banner. I'm gonna, I'm start putting up banners over here now. But uh, we got some stuff to do. As in, look at all these damn flails, dude. Platinum Pumpkin Masher. Some of these are sweet as hell. The Planetoid. Oh. Sandstorm. Did it say Sandstorm? Yeah, Sandstorm. Stinger. Blue Phase Whip. Adamantite Whip. Whips. What are, what are the difference between whips and then the actual flails themselves? We gotta see. Let's check it out right now. What flail can I make? Shit, whiplash. We can make whiplash. <laughs> what else? Uh, whip. Yeah, we can make a whip. Adamantite whip. Oh, butcher's hook. That shit looks sweet. Man, it sucks that I discovered this mod it's pretty late. But we can still make use of it. I see a whip. Alright, a whip is just a straight line. That's actually interesting. I don't think I'll use it. I don't know how, about, how I feel about shooting something in a straight line. But it's pretty cool. Uh, I'll sell this. Cause I don't think I will use whips. I don't. I don't really like the the use of just going in a straight line. But uh, let's take a look here. But what else we got? We're pretty much waiting for nighttime to arrive. What am I doing? Let's look at it like this. We're waiting for nighttime to arrive. And once nighttime arrives, we'll, we'll fight some bosses. Chlorophyte Lasher, Tri Whip. Ooh, that sounds interesting. Tri Whip can be really good. Uh, do we got anything like crazy unique looking? Not really. I guess the most unique one would be uh, the planetoids. Pretty unique, which I want to make that in the future. That'd be nice to make that in the future. But we gotta make this right here, the nightmare, the nightmare. We need a sun fury. Maybe while it's daytime, we can go on a hunt for uh, the sun fury. Let's just have everything ready, though. Let's have everything ready when it comes to fighting bosses. So. Oh, my armor's kind of ass. That's also something I want to do is work on my armor. So let's actually run through really quickly. Uh, I don't think I can mine anything Calamity right now. So can't make anything out of Calamity. So we'll go to Thorium. Our go-to mod. I'm going to burp. Am I? It kind of just, just vanished. All right. Uh, Wait. Nope, it vanished again. Okay, so how do we make these? All right, that was like a baby burp. I don't know if you guys heard it. Is there any armor I can make right now that would help a lot? I don't think there is. That would help the point I'm at right now. Not really. It's either this armor or the flesh armor. So yeah, let's just uh, get potions. We should have a decent amount of... Should I use heart reach? Why well, do I need heart reach? I don't know. Uh, but we should have a decent amount of day blooms. Yeah, that's okay. So let's get this going. And then... I will get a heart reach just in case because I, I think I did set up heart statues off camera I set up heart statues so those will help a lot but let's head back under 
and let's look for some shadow keys really quickly. We don't need the whole entire night to fight the twins. So we should be fine. Did I quick stack the twins things back in there? I don't know, whatever. Underground we go. I wanna find this this uh, flail so we can make use of uh, this new mod. Let's go back to it. Uh, the balance breakfast. <laughs> okay, it's uh, interesting. But yeah, this is what we wanna make here. What do we have? We have crimson here. So we gotta make the, uh, well, let's use this. Look at that, look at that. Oh my God, he got destroyed. We gotta, we gotta make the meatball. I think it's called, yeah, the meatball. So let's find some shadow chest. Hey, bye. <laughs> Holy shit, he died so quickly. This weapon is a dope ass weapon. Oh man, I forgot we got a boat in the last episode too. All right, shadow, shadow key chest. Where the hell are you? I just need some real quick. I can't fit through there. Can I fit through here? I can't. I need to upgrade my key. Wait, why do I like grow, glow green when I swing? Is that because of the dragon armor? I'm guessing it's because of the dragon armor. Any uh, shadow key chest down here? No, none. I swear I've seen some down here. We've gone pretty far to the left here. So there has to be some around soon. Because I did not explore this area too much. Uh oh. That's a bad thing. Don't do that. Oh shit. Hey. Can I get a mount? Come here. Come here, dude. Mount. Oh, that's rude. That's rude. Just give me the damn mount. Oh, I think we're coming up on him. I remember seeing one and being like, oh, I don't have my stuff to open it. Yep, there it is. Get in there. Get in there. You get out of here, man. Come on, now. Don't be so rude. All right, let's see what we got. Mm. Don't think I can use the flame lash in this playthrough. Obviously, I can. But uh, you get something like I wish I was able to use it. Just that, you know, flame lash has a has a personality, man. You'll hear it. If he has like, if he's living, if flame lash is living right there, he would have heard my sincerity that I wanted to use him. Oh, I did it again. I did that. I did that time on accident. All right, let's keep on going. I'm not seeing uh, fucking towers anymore. What? Is there like no hell towers over here? Aha! Come on, man. Can't do me like that. Can't do me like that. Come on, just one more. Just one more. One more chance, man. One more chest. One more chance. No! No, nothing at all. Alright, we gotta head back then. I don't know, what would be quicker? Heading back and heading... Whatever. We're going up. We're going up really quickly just to see if there's actually a recipe for the Sun Fury. It's a possibility. Aha! There is a recipe. Ten Hellstone and a Blue Moon. What is this? Ten Hellstone and a Blue Moon. Do I have a Blue Moon just chilling around anywhere? Probably not. Blue... I think you can make blue moons out of cobalt. Yeah. Ball of hurt in a in cobalt. All right, no problem. So we need 10 cobalt. So the problem is I don't have 10 cobalt, so we need to uh, switch bars here. Up, 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 up. 10. And we need to make, oh no, we do have demonite. So let's uh, make, what is it? The meat, the, the what? What was I supposed to make? <laughs> Ball of hurt. Can you make a ball of hurt? Oh shit, dude. Oh no, you can't make a ball of hurt. Oh, you just need a rotted pitchfork. Okay. So that's no problem then. Rotted pitchfork. Where the f oh my god, wait, I need a break. Ah! Can you make a rotted pitchfork? <laughs> There's a lot of a lot of work here. Rotted pitchfork. Okay. Spear oh my god, can you make a spear? Jesus. This is a lot of uh, pre-crafting we need. Tin. Ten tin. I know I got that. I know I got ten tin on deck. Ten tin. Ten tin. Come on, where is this ten tin? I'm having... Well, I don't know why I'm trying to look for ten tin. Uh, where is the spear is what I'm trying to look for. Okay, there's that. Rotted. Thank God to all these mods we have. Five and then... Okay, so if I just go like this, I should be able to make it. Right? Where would it be at though? The bottom? 
I guess somewhere towards the bottom would make sense, possibly. I don't know, I don't see it. Oh, here it is. Boom, okay. There, we have that. Ball of hurt. Oh, wait, we could have crafted one the whole fucking time. God damn it. Whatever. <laughs> I'll just, uh, just craft it like this. Boom, there we go. Blue moon on deck, and then we whip this baby open. And then we craft the sun fury. Bam, part one. Good job, me. You're welcome. We're running out of room in here, which is not too good to see. What are we making again? The moon? Something moon flail? Nope, it's not called moon flail. Uh, fuck, we'll just go to the mod again, which I gotta go all the way around. Because you can't right click and go back. Sadly. Alright, here we go. Nightmare, that's what we're trying to make. Blue moon, sun. Oh, fuck, we need to make another blue moon? Okay, that's no problem now that we know we can create a ball of hurt just like this. My bad for being blind and not seeing it the first time. But uh, you can't you can't blame me. There's so many goddamn flails. <laughs> so there's that. And then we craft the blue moon again. Uh, where's the blue moon at? Am I just not seeing it? How do you make a blue moon again? Do I not have enough cobalt? Oh, I don't have any cobalt. That's a problem. I have nothing but palladium. Stop! Palladium. I mean cobalt. That's what we want to make out of palladium. There we go. I did not mean to... Whatever, it's fine. Uh, wait a minute. Is there... Okay, I was about to say there was two different stacks. Now we can craft the blue moon yet again. There it is. Alright. Blue moon. But guess what else we need to craft again? <laughs> the fucking meatball. Can you just craft the meatball is my question? Stop. Eh. Meat. Ah, you can just craft the meatball. Ten and five. Okay. 10 and 5. So give me 5 of these. Now obviously we have 10. 10 of those. Boom. There's that. Now we need to create... What is the last one? The stinger. Oh, the sting. No. Sting. Let's do it that way. Stinger. So we need 12 stingers. Ha! Who would have known that? Oh, we actually have a decent amount. 12 stingers. Uh, 15 jungle spores. Damn, we got a good amount of those, too. Please tell me I got everything. One vine. Alright, we can make the stinger. Somewhere. There it is. Bam! That's all of them. But let's get to the dirty business here. Nighttime has arrived. Keeper on deck. Please get out of here. Okay. People are dead. Please, no. Can we not have... Why does it gotta be a blood moon? I literally had a blood moon the other day. This is pretty goddamn annoying that we gotta get one again. On this very important boss fight coming up. Time out! Hey! I was trying to fix something. I'm trying to scratch my arm. You gotta come over here and attack me. Okay. Let's do this. Let us do this. Everybody clear out, though. Clear out real quick. Buff. Places down. Buff. Fuck, we need the Eye of Cthulhu shit. No, why do I have feather? No, wait, what did I just get rid of? <laughs> oh my god. All kinds of fucking hell right now. Hello, uh... Excuse me. I canceled something. I think I canceled uh, the well-fed buff. Alright, let's do this. Oh my god, please fuck off! Get! Oh man. Oh man! Okay. There you go. We can do it now. Hey, how y'all doing? Can I do this? Oh god, that's not gonna work out. That's not gonna work out against this boss. This boss too mobile for that. Come on, man. Let's go, man. Alright, we'll stick to this because it does the most damage right now. Wait, I might be able to get some hits off. Alright, that was pointless. Okay. Hey, how you doing? Okay, let's switch to the boat. The boat will be probably better to have here so we don't have to worry about flight time. But let's obviously get this guy again. We were very close last time, if you guys remember. It's only an episode ago, so hopefully you remember. But we were really close last time. We just couldn't finish it. We just cannot finish it. I feel like I'm not hitting him enough. Come on. Come get in this. Come get in this constant damage right here. Do we need something equipped here? Some specific equipment? No, we don't. We're good. We're good. We just gotta just keep it on him the whole time. And we should be free to go. If I can get him to spin, 
This guy has a pretty quick spin animation once they transform. These guys have a pretty quick spin animation. But uh, if I can get him in that animation and get like a perfect spot to just keep on attacking him, then we can probably get a couple of hits off of the flail. And that would be really nice. Get that couple extra hits off. Here we go. Here we go. Come on, soon. Come on, soon. Anytime now. Come on. Just do it. There we go. Hey, hey, hey. There we go. We got a couple of hits off. We got a couple of hits off. I will take that. I will take those couple of hits off. Come on, man. Where you at? Come get some hits. We got to still keep pretty good distance away from this guy. This is my best yo-yo right now. I have, to, I have a, the list of yo-yos up on my other monitor right now. And I think the Spasmatasm has a chance to drop a yo-yo. Oh, God. Might as well get hits on the Retinizer. So we got to take this guy out quick so we can get to the Retinizer, which should not should be really easy once we take out one of them. Because that's how the twins work. I'm trying to do damage, but it's kind of hard. It's kind of hard when he's blowing flames at you. Hold up. Hey, hey. Wait, what just happened there? I don't know what happened there. Come on, dude. Let me get them hits off. Alright, dash, let's go. See, this flail you can use a lot because it detaches every time you use it. If you read that, after an enemy in the channel stats, send the ball randomly crashing around. Very useful. Let's go, dude. Let's go, dude. You're coming to your demise. It's gonna be your demise. Oh, shit, I missed that. Might as well get some hits off on this guy, you know? Get both of them somewhat low. Alright. Come on, you gotta be dead soon. What is your health at? 2,000. Ow! I'm getting stuck right now. Time out. Three, okay. Here we go, here we go, here we go. We're getting him, we're getting him. We're getting him, he's close, he's close. Let's get all these hearts real quick. So got half the night, we're, we should be fine. I don't know why I tanked those shots there. Okay, there we go. He's dead. Whoa, hey. Chill with that launch. Did he drop his yo-yo? It'd be nice if he dropped his yo-yo. He didn't drop his yo-yo. It's too bad. All right. We can go in on this guy. This guy can get it. Not in that type of way, though. I don't think that type of way, man. I ain't, getting, I ain't giving him shit. Besides these yo-yos. Want some yo-yos, man? Want some yo-yo collection? Yeah, yeah. There we go. That's some DPS right there. We are up really high right now. Oh no, lasers. We're too high up in space. I can't dodge the lasers. Okay, I can dodge those lasers. I have no idea where he's at right now, so it's kind of hard to hit. There you are. Hey. Oh, god damn. I mean, he's really weak. He's really inferior compared to the other. <laughs> We're going to fight this guy all day. At least aim. At least, like, aim a little bit ahead. Try when you aim. I'm just standing right in the middle, man. I'm giving you, like, cheap shots. Damn, we didn't get a fucking yo-yo ball that worked. That sucks. All right. Oh, chill out. Who's shooting lasers? You know how tired I am in these laser noises? Pretty goddamn tired of this laser noise, man. Get out of here. Get out of here. Get out of here. So hopefully we can get through a couple mech bosses in this episode. I'm not sure though. We'll see. Uh, we got a good bit of stuff from fighting him. Get out of here. We just gotta clear out. Everybody clear out. Clear out. Dude, this flail is fucking superior to all other flails. Alright, let's turn off these heart things. I don't think I want to challenge another boss with how much time we have left in the day. So we won't. Instead, we will just cash in all our stuff. All right, so we got all four flails on deck. Really quickly, I want to talk to the guide about these. Boom, because I think there's a very specific weapon we can make here. And I know y'all see it. Damn, did they add in more weapons? Looks like there's a good bit of weapons now. Boom, Eye of the Destroyer. We need 12 of those. Holy shit. That is a good bit here. Hey, my boy, Flacken, do you sell anything else now? Mechanical eyes. So after every time you beat a boss, they sell new stuff. Uh, he's not selling cryogen stuff yet. But yeah, we gotta run to a demon altar. What the fuck would a demon altar be? To the right or to the left? Which one would be faster? Left. To the left. 
But yeah, we're gonna run to the left real quick. Might as well pick up all this stuff. See no reason not to. Okay. We're gonna go to the left, do this, and then we're gonna get ready for another boss fight. And hopefully I can use this new flail to advantage. This flail is kinda eh. You know, flails, they don't have really special effects to them, or if they aren't hitting extremely hard when you hit someone with them. They're not the easiest weapon to make 100% use of. Uh, especially in hard mode. Like, really, really, really hard to make use of them in hard mode. At least this one. Like, this is just... Look at the range on there, too. Like, come on. It's slow. Slow. Short range. Like, there's no upsides going for this one. Which is all good. Who did that? Was that you? Better have been you. Alright, Nightmare. Boom. Let's see how the flails from this mod work. Let's see how nice they are. Yeah, they're pretty nice. They feel just like all the other flails. Uh, quickly, is that Lodestone? Shit, that is Lodestone. Okay. Lodestone, lucky for us. Lodestone is actually what we need when it comes to... Ooh, we can actually make Lodestone armor too. I might have to make Lodestone armor and get rid of this uh, dragon armor. But Lodestone armor, really good because that is the... Uh, that, that, will, uh, that is the... Uh, the ore that drops, or the ore that can create the flail out of the two. Pretty sure a Valadium does not have the ability to craft a flail. Oh, I meant to say, Ooh, this thing hits fucking hard. Yeah, this is a material, I think we need ectoplasm though to make the planetoid. Cynthia the steampunker has arrived. Good for her. I made a bunch of new houses. If you guys can tell. I did a lot of off camera stuff. Man, I just want some goddamn lodestone. You gotta attack me. Okay, let's turn these lodestone ingots or these lodestone chunks into lodestone ingots. And let's check out the armor set. Increases melee. Ooh, this can help out a lot. This can help us out a lot here. And look at this. Attacks thunder the enemy defense immensely. So we are gonna switch. Ooh, I don't know if we'll switch out right now. Because we do have the nightmare on deck. And this thing is pretty goddamn hard. What is the planetoid? That's what it's called. Planetoid. So yeah, we need 10 ectoplasm, which obviously we can't get ectoplasm yet. Hollowed shit. <laughs> yeah, that's what it's called too. That's what it's referred to. Hollowed shit. Uh, let's see here. What can I make th with this stuff? Anything that really will affect me at this moment? Hollowed flail might be good to use. The Eye of Calamitas. Uh, I don't think I can really make use of that right now. This guy is coming up. I think after the mech boss. Is he pre-Plantera, I believe? So he's coming up. Maybe I should just make that hollowed uh, flail. I'm going to do it for now. No reason not to. Let's just try it out. Well, let's see the range on it. Head up into our testing area. Let's see the range here. Oh, you got to stand in the red. In the middle of the red. Decent. That gets halfway through uh, purple pretty good that does ha go halfway through purple this is w really fast and it goes almost to the it goes half point yeah it does, definitely goes half point of uh, yellow too but uh, let's see the damage decent to say the least what about without the, that armor on yeah there's a crit in there every once in a while and that crit's pretty goddamn high so I don't think we'll use a nightmare for now. Uh, instead, we'll use the hollowed flail. Well, I don't know. Let's see. Let's see which one shoots out really fast. I really like the not the exact spriting on the item, but the spriting on the uh, when the flail's out itself. It's really nice. Look at that. It's pretty sweet looking. Represents this too. But uh, let's put away the nightmare and let us let us up. Uh, Get more lodestone if I can. What time of day is it? Yeah, we still got a while. Get more lodestone. See if I can craft this armor before uh, nighttime arrives. So while we're mining, I switched to the lodestone breaker, by the way. But while we're mining, I'm going to do something that I was supposed to do, like every video, every Terraria video, but I forgot. Oops, sorry. But I'm going to ask you guys a question. I'm going to ask you guys a comment question of the day. I want to hear what you, what your guys' ideas would be. For this question right here. Ready? If you guys were to make a flail, and that flail were to have special abilities, 
what would these special abilities be? Mine, it would kind of be like... I don't know, I feel like it'd have to be an adaptation of the Juggernaut right now, which I don't have a reforge. Holy shit, I just noticed that. But it would have to be an adaptation of that. But you know how the... The, how yo-yos, they have the... What, what the fuck are they called? I don't know what they're called. Uh, the things that fly around when you use the yo-yo, the little tiny ones. Shit, hold up. What are they called? The little counterweights, there you go. It'd be something like that. So you're to use the flail, and once you hit something, like three more little flails, like little tiny baby flails came out and hit everything around. I think that'd be really sweet to have something like that. That's my idea. I would call it the uh, counter flail, obviously. The most superior name. I bet you guys never would have guessed that name. Hold up here. I need to get this lodestone, man. This is important. This is important. I'll risk my life for that lodestone. And I'll place the obsidian back down because I don't care. Who the hell cares? Alright, lodestone. We're still on the hunt here. But yeah, let me put in the comments. I want to hear what you guys want to say. Or what you guys make about that. What does Sundering do? Jesus Christ, that was a lot. Sunder. Tax was Sunder. Wait, it said defense? Yeah, okay. So that's what it does. It just shows defense. Okay. I didn't know if it said it or not. I just kind of read it. Sunder. Bam, this should be the last piece. Lodestone. Hopefully our movement is in decrease. No, it's not. Okay, that's a good thing. I'm tired of wearing this fucking Mirage Diamond. I just want to see my beautiful armor in peace. These guys were playing rock, paper, scissors, and that shit got, I got messed up. Got messed up because of that slime. Way to go, slime. Way to mess up their rock, paper, scissors game. That was an epic match, I can tell. By the emotions on their faces. Look at their emotions. You can see so many of them. So many emotions on the NPCs' faces. Alright, let's make mannequin here. Alright, let's make two of them right now. Make a one mannequin. One mannequin. And we will put these up here. To display our next set some armor boop boop and boop so there we go there's that we got potions on deck campfires on deck because I switched out those campfires uh can I make a heart lantern that'd be something nice to make yes we can okay so let's do that I know there's a couple other items from I think the uh, cosmic ver cosmetic variety mod that we can put on the ground and I probably should eventually like put stuff like that on the ground, but it's all good. Let's head over here. Now the question is, should I do this destroyer boss fight with a uh, destroyer box? Or should I just fight it free form? I think I'm going free form. Because I feel like free form is, uh, you know, test, test our might. And I want to see where we're standing at right now. You know where we're standing at? We're staring, standing in our inventory room. <laughs> good joke, Game Raiders. All right, let's do this. Nighttime is here. Mechanical worm on deck. Uh, oh, I do need a heart reach potion. This would be good for a heart reach potion. Fuck, I gotta make more of these. That or I gotta go find some. Because these are gonna be useful as hell. But let's get them out here. All we gotta do is buff. We'll be set to go. Now let me run over here to this one. Hit this. Add a light or two here. This low key is dark. Okay. Let's do this. Hey, how you doing? Great start. Good job, Gamer. Let's try this. Okay. Not a good start by fucking getting hit by his head all the time. Stay moving. Stay moving. Stay moving. Holy lasers everywhere. Okay. The probes are something we want to kill high key. Because they drop, they drop, uh, what is it? They drop a yo-yo, which is going to be really useful. Hey, hello. So let's see if we can just get that yo-yo. Oh, shit, we did get the yo-yo. It's in our inventory right now. I don't want to use it in this fight because what I'm doing right now is working. So I don't want to just change it up in the middle of the fight. Hold up. Let's see if we can get some of this going. Get the fuck out of here. Sunder, sunder, get some sunder on him. Get some sunder. All right, this is working. This is working. But I think I'll stay with this because this is what is doing work. Actually, this is getting all the parts at once. Look at this! Oh my god! Oh my god! This is the best flail. Oh my! Oh my! Oh my! 
it's over just like that all right we can test this out oh man i'm hyped i'm hyped for that now there's multiple versions of this and when i say that i mean okay we can let's find another boss we're gonna try to make another boss. there's multiple versions as in holy shit that hurt you as in uh there's one from thorium and there's also one from uh yo yo overload mod. but we'll use both of them get the use off of both of them here we're using this one to advantage. See, can I sunder you, dude? Actually, can I just do this? You need to come back down, though. I don't want to. I don't want to keep on going up. I don't want to keep on going up. Come on down. Come on down. Come on down. There we go. Motherboard on deck. I never kill those things with like hands. I don't know if it makes life easier or not. We got a lot of health to work to get down here, don't we? Let's see what's faster. There we go. Icor on him. See if we can sunder him too. Icor and sunder, that'd be like extremely low defense. Oh shit, they broke off. How y'all hands doing? Alright, and then I'll switch back to the Dawn Star. I want to upgrade from the Dawn Star, but I mean, I guess this is our upgrade. I don't exactly know how much damage this does do. This does do. This does go, is what I meant to say. Oh, 6-7 is actually really good. Yeah, I'll, I'll keep it out for now. This is not a bad boss fight. I don't know uh, what's going on with the Tremor update anymore. Uh, there's a lot of things going on over there. They're just It's just not finished right now from what I know. So I still got a while before that comes out anytime soon. But, you know, they've been releasing spoilers here and there. And it looks really good. It looks really good. Everything's coming along really good from what I can see. Other than just, like, timing. But uh, let's end this man's goddamn career. Sunder on deck. And then I hit him with a couple of these all over for you sadly he doesn't drop the uh strange plating would be nice but it's all good burning burning motherboard is that what that says burning motherboard do i have anything to set you on fire not really oh try and catch it try and catch it little dude this thing goes fucking ape shit look at this oh ape shit on him. The meters frame rate dropping right now. Whoa, what is going on right now? The frame rate and the like speed of the game drop. What, what the heck? There we go. Was it him? Bullshit, it was him. Hey, you guys need to die. Can we come down to earth and let me kill you guys real quickly? All right, I think that went really well. You get a lot from that. Hey, man, come here. Come here. Come here. There we go. How many do we need to craft the uh, the one from Thorium? The laser one from Thorium. Holy shit, this is the best. This is the best yo-yo. I mean, the lasers come out pretty weird, but it's still it's a dope-ass yo-yo. So we got Souls of Might on deck. Let's talk to uh, Luke real quick. Boom, let's see what we can make with these. What kind of things that will... Ooh, Cosmic Worm. We're gonna, it's going to be a while before we fight that guy. So let's see, Might in a Bottle. Interesting. Might in a bottle. There's also this bottle soul, bottled soul of might. Let's look here. I have the destroyer. It does do more than this base damage wise. So let's take a look here. Ah, fuck. We do need 12. Okay. That sucks. Okay. We can uh, see here. Soul of sight. Which I think this is the opposite of the destroyer. No. Is it the opposite of the destroyer? Or is it just here for fun? Can't you use this instead of soul of might to create some things? Yeah, you can. That's good. We still need Skeletron though. Bottled Soul of Mine. What does this do? Oh, that's not really that useful. I think this one's useful though. Where is it? Bottled Soul of Mine. I think this one does damage. Yeah. 2% damage before and 5% damage if increased. I wish they. I hope, hopefully they uh, buff that. Tremor buffs that in the future because 12% damage increase when worn. That's not that good. At least give you like 5 defense too on the side with that. That would be really nice. Hey, we get a beautiful helmet out of all this. That's all that matters in the end. Okay, so before we end off this episode, we made a good bit of progress and everything. I'm probably going to fight these guys again off camera. I don't know. I'm, I'm, I got I to gotta go work on the range world because I got to build houses on that world. And, uh, oh, shit. Yeah, I'll take it. Let's test out the range here on the... Oh, my God. Look at that. It goes past the fucking red. Wait. Yeah, it does go past the red, but look, it's kind of like reels back. Okay. 
So it does go into the white. It goes to where the white is. Okay. That's good to know. This is a really far yo-yo. This is probably our main one now over at the uh, Dawnstar. Hold up. Stand in the middle. Dawnstar goes past the red. Let's make sure. Was I standing in the middle? Okay, so it does go a little bit past the red. Not in, really in the white. It's, a, it's tipping into the white. Let's see what we get from that. Ooh, we're Calcum. And, uh, yeah, in the next episode, we'll continue fighting, uh, bosses, and we'll try and gather, hold up, time out. does my boy sell what I think he sells now? He might sell it after we fight Skeletron. Oh, he does sell it. Alright, we'll go over that in the next episode. I'll see you guys next time.